Hi Leo, I hope you're doing well. So we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about here for the rest of the year. A little bit of Scorpio. Yeah, and any of the fixed signs. You are coming through in your reading strong. So that's, I like that, it's nice. Their overall energy. So we have North Node, Leo, Five of Wands, the Devil in Reverse, Seven of Pentacles in Reverse, and we have them represented by Father here. Um, the light attributes could be talent for creating and supporting life, positive guiding light within a tribal unit, shadow attributes, a dictatorial control, abuse of authority. Yeah, this person, well, they could be a father, but paired with the devil in reverse, this person could have been a bit, you know, my way or the highway. There were some abusive qualities. I don't know, maybe control issues. It really depends, but very conflicted person. Some of you, this person could be a performer of sorts or, you know, they get a lot of attention. Um, people vying for their attention that is also coming through here there's some magnetic quality to them but it's almost this person doesn't feel control over this situation so they're almost have no choice but issues that they, they're trying to work on themselves perhaps heal but there is a lot of inner conflict coming through some of you this can be external factors as well perhaps if you're in contact um literally there's arguments or jealousy possessiveness or it can be other issues like fa with family members or workplace but they they yeah it's a bit of a annoying period is how i describe it for them where they're not seeing eye to eye with the people around them for how they're viewing you leo this is beautiful we have nine of pentacles five of cups in reverse this person loves um your independence and the way you take care of yourself um, they see you as someone who's quite, yeah, you're self-reliant, perhaps very secure within yourself that you're getting over that, right? You're getting, you're reclaiming your power almost and that, yeah, at one point you were upset about this mourning, this connection, but you're almost over it is how they're perceiving you. Oh, I forgot to get your mixed emotions. Yeah, I'll do that. Um, but for their feelings, we have all three reversals we have ace of swords in reverse sun in reverse the world in reverse this person has a lot of questions in regards to you but it's almost there's a lack of communication or it's if you are communicating it's not the most open and honest and this person feels that they don't have the closure that they need there's unhappiness Ooh it's almost they're unfulfilled is their energy because they feel let's see let's get your mixed emotions and then we'll talk about it interesting yeah they feel they don't have control over the situation bold move towards you you know muster up that courage if there's no contact but we also have their prominent energy as receptive open accepting welcoming i'm not sure you are we'll see what your energies in a second but yeah they're right now their energy towards you is open but they are confused and they feel they have lack of clarity in regards to the situation what action they'll take towards you we do have six of wands and knight of cups in reverse they don't feel recognized by you leo um they feel that you're not giving them any attention as a result they're not really expressing much at least no emotional expression here some of them it may be a fear of rejection which is why they're holding back that's for few of you the obstacle here we have hermit eight of cups ace of wands and six of swords in reverse well for some of you it can be that one person is still healing from a past situation which is why there's a lack of a start here 
um, where, yeah, there needs to be some healing before there can be, before someone can invest more time and energy into this connection. And for the others of you, I'm getting one person is a bit isolated. It may be you, Leo, where you may be taking a break from this situation or this person is in order to sort of there may be a sense a lack of control which may be a bit scary so one person's almost withdrawing their energy to sort of regain their composure is what i'm getting to get a different perspective on things right if, if because it's six of swords and eight of cups very stuck energy emotionally and mentally so that is what is sort of stagnating the situation is there's a tad bit of codependency here as well i'm seeing I'm not getting any like very toxic energy in this spread but there there are some issues with moving forward perhaps unable to forget what happened in the past there's some lack of trust here on one person's side for the outcome for you or should we look at your feelings? Let's see your feelings. So we do have a Wheel of Fortune upright, the Emperor and Strength in reverse. So for you, Leo, for the first half of the month, you're sort of going with the flow, trusting the universe. You're not trying to control anything. You're going with the flow. Um, it's a beautiful period where you're at peace almost because you're trusting in the divine is what I'm getting but you're not trying to control anything and that's where you're at for wheel of fortune and feelings is sometimes can be up and down right one day you're feeling okay the other day you're feeling a different way and it's a bit of a cycle you're in so it, it's a little bit of moodiness coming through as well for a few of you for your outcome we have the queen of swords and nine of wands in reverse seven of cups upright three of swords in reverse there may be a tad bit of bitterness on your side leo or a lack of trust which i was getting on and some of you are healing from this situation perhaps even exploring what else is out there seven of cups and those of you that are still invested in this connection and you're not interested in anyone else it could be that little bit of curiosity you know where you're trying to figure out what this person is doing here there's confusion so you get you're trying to get to the root of the issue here but it's almost tired exhaustion in your energy where you're almost you know unwilling to fight for it any longer for some of you for their outcome we have page of cups six of cups in reverse ace of cups this person in their outcome is has emotion for you um they have their eye on you and if yeah i was getting longing in their mixed emotions right yeah for their feelings i see that here um even if things went a bit chaotic or you know something went wrong between the both of you with the six of cups in reverse they still think of you fondly um it's yeah this is affection this is emotion and this is care um for another so they do care about you here in their outcome you're a bit closed off from them but in their outcome it's all cups right mm. let's get some messages from them leo Wow, your cards are flying everywhere. Interesting. Yeah, <laughs> I want to reach out to you, but you send me mixed signals. I want to be certain you want me. It's perhaps too intense, and one person pulled their energy back. That makes sense because, yeah, Six of Swords, Eight of Cups in reverse, maybe this person's energy, maybe mutual, where one person was very much engrossed um, in your energy if it's this person almost you know obsession being in a maze i'm trying to find clever ways to win you over yeah and this person will be back i don't see they're still very much invested right i was telling you that lack of clarity with the sun and ace of swords 
Yeah, they're very confused by you. They find you very mysterious, Leo. Let's see what this deck has for you. Messages from this person to Leo. I'm not sure I'm feeling that, Leo. Messages. I'll take them. <laughs> yeah, we have, we don't think the same way. Yeah, that five of wands in their overall energy, there may be some clashes here um, in regards to your beliefs, perhaps. Yeah, will you take care of me? <laughs> yeah, they, they may be a tad bit clingy here. I'm getting that in their outcome. They want you to be more emotionally vulnerable and available to them. And we have, I am worried that you are interested in someone else. Okay, some of them think that there's competition here. Um, that you have your eye on other people. You were coming through as single and happy. So yeah, they think you have other people vying for your attention. For your advice, Leo, we have... Number 21, healing. So we have, if you are experiencing stress, feel overwhelmed, are suffering ailments in your body, or feel exhausted and depressed. I was getting exha exhaustion in your outcome. It means that your body is trying to communicate with you. Your body wants you to start treating it in a more loving manner and listening to the messages it is sending you. You need to become conscious of the areas in your life that you are avoiding or suppressing. Healing takes time. It is a process. Your first step towards healing is to create a safe, loving, supportive environment where you can listen to your inner wisdom. For action, they say take a few deep breaths and relax. Relax your body. Place your hands on an area in your body where you have feelings, memories. Mm. Imagine a green light moving through your body and repairing it. Gently bring your awareness back to normal and open your eyes. Now it's almost, you know, use your mind to heal yourself if you've been feeling, you know, when we're stressed, that can physical pain. You know, there's some meditations, guided meditation for self-healing on YouTube, if that is something you're interested in, because I am seeing a lot of exhaustion here. Um, some of you, it can be, I'm not getting depression, but everyone's story is different and the way we process things will differ, right? But yeah, do reach out if you need help and listen to their the meditations we have available on YouTube. But yes, Leo, that is what I have for you. Take care of yourself and enjoy the rest of your day. I will see you next week. Bye.